Dan Brennan joins us from Dublin this morning. Happy St. Patrick's Day, sir. Thank you, Ben. Hi, Susanna, and a very happy St. Patrick's Day to all you guys. Oh, it's lovely to see you. What are you actually going to be doing today, Brendan? You've got an official role, haven't you? Yes, I'm, I'm, I'm the Grand Marshal of the uh, Dublin Parade, which is a, a huge honour. I didn't think it was going to be as big a deal as it is when, it, when I was asked to do it in, in November. It sounded like a great idea. Um, and uh, it's, it's very, very cold, but it's very, it's very ceremonial. It's very, I, I'm, I'm the queen of Dublin today. It's very much Madagascar, you know, smile and wave, boys, smile and wave. <laughs> but the Grand Marshal, that's some title, Brendan. What, what does your role involve? Uh, I, 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 it's, a, it's a very ambassadorial role, actually. It's, it's, it's to try and make uh, Dublin look, look good, um, which I, I think I do that anyway. Uh, and it's also to, to bring a festive, uh, a, f a festive feel to, to what's going on because there's, there's events happening all over. The, 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 the theme this year is very much the arts, and, and um, we've got f events happening all over the Dublin city all week, not just today. Uh, we've got carnivals, we've got street theatre, we've got so many things happening, and it's to give an impression and to give an idea uh, to people of exactly what's happening in Dublin on St Patrick's weekend. We've got St Patrick's weekends coming up from now on forever. <laughs> so if you want to come to Dublin on St Patrick's weekend, this is what you're going to get. It's a great opportunity to celebrate, of course, Brendan. For, for many people watching, <laughs> including my um, children, can you explain the legend of St Patrick and why he's celebrated so enthusiastically? Well, he, he, he actually is the one that brought Christianity to, to uh, the heathen Irish. And uh, now we're back being heathens again, because we, we could do with him. But he, he's the one that explained the blessed trinity to um, two Irish people, that there was three people in the one God. And he did that by holding up a shamrock and, and explaining how there was three leaves to a shamrock, but there's only one shamrock. Um, he also uh, allegedly drove the snakes out of Ireland, but apparently we still have a government. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's not get political. <laughs> not today. Uh, so so what, what are you most looking forward to, Brendan? You've been, I imagine, going to this uh, parade for many years now. What are the moments that you really enjoy? Well, I'm, I have to tell you, I'm enjoying... Uh, all week I've been enjoying the, the fact of being the Grand Marshal of the Dublin Parade. Uh, for a Dubliner particularly, it's, it's, a, it's a huge honour. But uh, I was only thinking over the last couple of days, I remember coming to this parade, and I've come to this parade every year from the time I was a tot. And I can remember at one stage standing there in my plastic sandals with no socks on me, uh, my trousers in tatters, watching the parade going by, and never once even imagining for a moment that someday I'd be leading it and, and it's it's so it's 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 very emotional.